A historic general store that's been closed for several months is now back open in the Poconos. The new owners are offering more than just deli items and groceries. Newswatch 16's Amanda Eustace shows us how they are encouraging others to pay it forward. There's hustle and bustle once again inside the deli at the Shawnee General Store near Delaware Water Gap. Nice to meet you. After sitting vacant for six months, the shop in Smithfield Township is back open under new ownership. Kelly Seabrig and her best friend Tara Molina closed on the property at the end of December and have been open for less than a month. We knew that like it's so cute and quaint that it wouldn't stay on the market long and so we got home, came to see it, fell in love, and our offer got accepted the end of the year. It's a place both women frequently visited for several summers for a bite to eat. But buying a coffee or breakfast sandwich at the shop they now own means a lot more than it did in previous years. We'll do pay forward. The general store has a way where you can help the next person in line. A simple message the owners say pays it forward. Kelly Ray's mom saw it somewhere and she brought it into the store. She's like, what do you guys think? I was like, yes, I've never heard of it either. Yeah. And uh, it blew my mind. I just love the, the idea of it. Now the concept of paying it forward is pretty simple. You can choose any item off of their menu and then you can address it to a person. It could be as general or as specific as you'd like. Good things still happen. Um, and paying it forward is one of those karma, you know, yeah. you do a nice thing and a nice thing will come back to you. Each one of these cards on the wall represents an item that's already been paid for. If it fits your description, you can use it. Seeing the kindness from others, Steve Sheptak and his wife decided to pay it forward and purchase a breakfast sandwich. Well, I think more people ought to do that and it's a, it's a great idea. It helps people out who need help and that's what people should be doing all the time. There has been people who have given several and donated several and it's just nice to see that people in the community are still kind and caring and want to give back to other people. You never know who you're going to get. Yeah. Like someone purchased one for June. Yeah. I don't know who June is, but I hope to find out. <laughs> <laughs> A sure sign there have been more givers than takers when it comes to paying it forward. I'm Andy Eustace, Newswatch 16, Monroe County.